Hi, Tammy here with Miners Leisure World. Join me as I take you through the Cedar Creek 371 FL. Cedar Creek is a high-end class model, quality fit and finish, high-end insulation, and is a full profile fifth wheel. This is a five slide couples coach. Let's get started. On the front here, they do have the air ride hitch, which is really nice. So what the air ride hitch does is it lessens the vibration and chucking when you're towing the coach. Front compartment here, it is generator prep, so it does not have the generator, but it is prepped. So if you were wanting to add that, that's something that we could do in-house and our boys would do the plumbing for the exhaust and whatnot. Moving along to the side here, your, you've got your two 30-pound propane tanks up front, the front living, just the way that it's designed. You do not have your front storage pass-through like you would on other models. However, they've done a great job of the storage in the back. So let's go check that out. So they've really done a great job back here. Nice wide compartment doors, totally unobstructed storage in here. Tons of room to put whatever you need, whether it be totes, larger camping items, and you actually have access to the storage from the back of the coach as well. So again, nice, large, deep, wide um, cargo door here. Comes with your ladder to access your roof, and it is also equipped with the observation camera. So over on what we call the roadside of the 371 FL, um, little storage up here, not much, but you do have the compartment here where your batteries would be housed. You do have your easy reel cord reel, which is really nice. So you can reel your cord up on there when you are set up at camp. If you wanted to have a water hose on there, you can pretty much use it for any type of hose or electrical cords as well. And we've got your fully enclosed service center here as well. Another nice feature on this coach is the size of the awning. So there's actually two power awnings. You've got one off the front here and one off the back and they span almost the whole length of the trailer. So you've got lots of shade. Um, they are power awnings, so easy to use. And we've got the frameless windows as well. So your tinted thermal pane frameless windows on the Cedar Creek. So I'm standing inside the kitchen here of the 371 FL Cedar Creek. As you enter, you've got a little bit of a countertop here, gr some great storage below. They have the easy monitor panel here, which is also run by an app on your phone. So really getting into total convenience throughout the whole RV industry. We've got pantry here with some cupboards up top and a bank of drawers below, full extension drawers. Off to the side here, they do have just a tall cabinet for your broom. Um, the coach is equipped with central vac, so probably where you would want to store your central vac attachments and that sort of thing. 18 cubic foot two-way refrigerator, so this is your propane and electric fridge. Nice big space in there for your freezer and your cold goods. They've got this nice classy four burner gray stone um, stove and oven, so a little bit larger than what you're normally going to see. Nice big oven in there, lots of room to do some baking if you want, or maybe cook, a something, cook something a little extra special for supper, and your convection microwave. Right next to the stove, we've got the ever-famous Cedar Creek Pantry. So what I love about this is they do have your pull-out drawers, and there's actually a plug-in back there, so if you wanted to maybe keep your toaster on this one drawer, you totally could do that and it's out of the way. So on your solid surface countertop island, we have the nice big sink, and I love what Cedar Creek does with their sinks. So you've got nice size sinks. This one is really good size, and even the side sink here for drying and whatnot is an excellent size, and they include these little drying racks as well. On the back side of the island here, you've got a full open cabinet here, so that may be where you would store your garbage can. And again, a bank of drawers off to the side here, built-in cutlery little divider as well. So lots of storage in this kitchen. They've done a really nice job of it. Off into the slide here, you do have your dinette. Right now, as you can see, you've got the two chairs, but it does come with an extra two folding chairs. So if it's just the two of you, you might not wanna have the other chairs kicking around, but if you do have company, it's a nice option to bring out the folding chairs. Cedar Creek features your two window shades. So you've got your full room darkening shade 
as well as your sunshade. So that's really nice. You can just kind of leave the sunshades down during the day and then in the evening you can have your full blackout blinds. Off to the side of the kitchen here is a little half bath. So you've got your porcelain foot flush toilet and a sink and vanity. It's a great option, especially in the front living if you have company staying maybe on your fold out sofas. They don't have to uh, traipse through your bedroom to get in to use the washroom. So as I mentioned, this is the 371 FL Cedar Creek. I'm up here in the living space. Wow, <laughs> great living area here. You've got your two tri-fold sofas. They both fold out and they, they do both fit with a little bit of space in between when you have them both folded out. So this coach technically could sleep up to six people. We've got your entertainment system here with the nice big window. So if you're not, um, if you're not using your TV, you have a great view out front here. Your TV comes up out of the credenza just with a switch here. Nice and easy to maneuver. And then when you're not using it, tuck it away. And like I said, you've got that great view. You've got some storage, um, some countertop storage on either side of the TV with plugins, your AM, FM, Bluetooth DVD player as well and your electric fireplace. In addition to the two trifold sofas, you also have your power reclining theater seats up here too for your comfort. Join me as we move along into the master bedroom. As you come up the hallway here, they've got some more great storage. Like this coach really has a great amount of storage. So you've got shelving up there. And then this, I guess, would be considered your coat closet. There are a few hooks in here. You can totally add a few more hooks. And if you wanted to, you could probably even put a pressure um, bar in there for hangers and whatnot. Let's move along. Up in the master bedroom here, we have your RV king size bed. So that's in the slide out. Nice space on either side of the bed as well. At the foot of the bed, we have again, more storage. Your TV mounted up on the wall here. You've got your pull out drawers, cabinets on either side as well for hanging and a couple shelves on the bottom. So you've kind of maybe got his and hers. And a little hidden gem here, this countertop lifts up. So if you have maybe some valuables that you wanna tuck away in there, you can totally do that. Last but not least, we're moving into the master bathroom here. Wow, I think this washroom is bigger than the one that I have at home. So this is your master bathroom here. You've got two sinks. So again, his and her sinks. Lots of storage here in the vanity. Your porcelain foot flush toilet. This is where the unit is also equipped and plumbed for washer dryer. So if you wanted to have a washer dryer unit in here, you could. And it does utilize the stackables or you just use it as your closet with then there's a hanging rod in there as well. Nice full residential, um, residential style shower. Nice big tub surround with some shelves in there. And then you have your glass sliding doors as well. More storage here for your linens as well. And they're actually pretty, they're nice and tall and they've got some depth to them. So thanks for joining me on this tour of the 2022 Cedar Creek 371 FL. Again, five slide front living couples coach with a bath and a half, great insulation. So it is definitely gonna extend your camping or maybe if you're gonna haul it down south, it also has the 12 volt heat pads on the tanks for extra protection. If you have any questions, give us a call at Minard's Leisure World, Weyburn and Watchers, Saskatchewan.